a murder suspect takes his own life following an hours-long standoff with Philadelphia police. Audience News reporter Henry Rossoff joins us live now from the scene in Germantown with details. Good morning, Henry. Good morning, uh, Jan and Rahel. Police right now just babysitting what's left of this scene. Most officers have cleared out, but this was a more than 12 hour ordeal that started in one part of town, ended here, and police at one point were taking gunfire. These events took us from the 1200 block of Sanger Street to the 4200 block of Broad Street and now here to the 1300 block of Haines Street. So we still have our work cut out investigatorily to just see what, uh, investigatively, just, just to, to put everything together. It began around 1.15 yesterday afternoon on Sanger Street. Police found a woman shot and killed in front of a house. The suspect was immediately identified as someone she knew, and his car was spotted in the 15th district. He fled police and crashed near Broad and Roosevelt. He then ran to this location near MLK High School. The suspect made it to the roof and fired a shot at responding officers. He then went back inside and fired yet another round from the front door and another out the back. So officers took up tactical positions to wait him out and negotiate. Neighbors were told to stay indoors. Finally, around 1.30 this morning, there was another gunshot. The SWAT team made entry and found the murder suspect shot himself in the head. Even as we stand here today, as we you know look back on it, thankfully there were no other injuries um, with regard to that. And um, but it did result in that conclusion. This neighborhood just now starting to wake up with some neighbors popping their heads out their doors. They were locked down since about 630 last night, so people still wondering what's going on, what happened. We're going to go about talking to some of those neighbors right now, have a uh, live report a little bit later today. Live in Germantown, Henry Ross of CBS 3 Eyewitness News. All right, Henry, keep us up to date. Thank you.